Hello everyone, peace and love, Tierra Chardé here. I hope all is well and you're having a fabulous evening. I'm going to take a moment for everyone to get in the room. How is your hump day going? <laughs> Wednesday is hump day, right? Hey, welcome, welcome, peace and love. Come on in. You guys get ready to uh, start sharing these videos. You already know somebody's going to be able to benefit from this message. Welcome, welcome, peace and love. Hello, beautiful Yafa. How are you? Welcome. Come on in. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and get started. This evening's video is what a time to be alive, you guys. Um, and I was really inspired to talk about this because, you know, in the midst of everything that's going on, we have to really be grateful for where we are and thankful for this life. Um, we have to understand that it is an honor that we are here on this planet in this time and space. Don't mistake it. You know, we all have a role to play. Um, we all have a role to play in this, uh, in this life. You're exercising listening. <laughs> That's wonderful. Uh, we all have a role to play in this life and it is such an honor for us to be here right now. You know, our souls signed a contract to be here because we have work to do. Many of us are light workers, star seeds, high priestesses, empresses, goddesses. It doesn't even matter what uh, title you answer to. We're all here for a divine purpose. So I encourage you all to walk in your purpose. Um, you know, many of you guys know on the media, there's a lot going on. Celebrities are acting up. You know, there's always something on the news. Try to uh, detach from the media as much as you can because much of that stuff is just propaganda and distractions and just a method to get you to detach from your inner world and I say that a lot they really want us to look outside of ourselves because that way we can be manipulated you know they can implement a fear state in the people and you know we're acting out timelines and realities that's suitable for them but once we attach and connect with our inside our inner world that's where our strength is our power is and we realize you know that we are divine beings that we are sovereign and that we can't be manipulated you know and we don't have to be a part of any type of system we can completely detach from what they're wanting us to create so it is an exciting time to be alive, especially for the awakened. Many of you guys already know what time it is. You already know to not really feed into the messages that are on the news and what people are saying because you realize that this is a spiritual war. This is the divine feminine coming back into power. This is the time for light workers, star seeds. Like I said, it doesn't matter what title it is, but it's time for those who are chosen for a divine purpose to really rise up and unite and come together. So, you know, we're not even we're not even tripping off of what's on the news or what people are talking about. We're really connected to our inner world. We're really connected to the spirit world, you know, the ancestors, the spirit guides, the, you know, the angels, all of that, whatever you want to call them, we're really connected to the divine. So we're excited about this time. We understand what it means. We understand that, you know, this is a call for balance, for peace, unconditional love and harmony, and that we have people in place to help humanity get there, okay, get to where we're going. You know, this is ascension and, you know, people kind of have this whole... I don't know this like huge thought process when it comes to the word ascension but really it's transformation it's change it's growth it's stepping up to the higher levels and that's what we're doing as a people 
and many of us are in place to facilitate that or to lead the way or shine the light you know where the lighthouse is the triggers the spiritual catalysts and that's what we're here to do so it's an honor for us to be here and you have to look at it that way okay we all have a major role to play what is your role what is your purpose um and i say this a lot you know i specialize in birth chart reports and manifestation rituals and past life and north node reports and i do that type of work for many people and i'm seeing that if you know who you are if you study your astrology right because astrology is the basis of just about every single system that we are a part of you know mathematics um, just all sorts of things if you study that and you know who you are on an astrological astrological spiritual level you are empowering yourself you are taking charge of who you are you know what I mean and you like I said you can't be manipulated you can't be swayed you're like a tree with the deepest deepest roots and you know it really gives you a sense of confidence and more than confidence um self-awareness because self-awareness is more important than just confidence you know what i mean like to be confident is to know that you can excel in any situation but to be self-aware is like to really know that even on your worst day what you contribute in this world um how you're connected to every single person and every single thing you know nature these animals that's being self-aware so that is that's being the eagle right that's seeing the bigger picture you're able to zoom out and see everything for what it is so those of us who are on that level or we see things in that way we are excited to be here right now we are excited because we understand that it's an honor to be here. Um, also, in this time and space, you know, and to look at it um, according to like what's going on right now, like today, in the present moment, um, these karmic timelines, these karmic cycles are really wrapping up for many of you guys. Um, if you guys follow me on YouTube, I have, you know, my series I'm doing Monday through Friday, Divine Message for the Collective on uh, Tierra Neo Chardé. The links are in the description box, by the way, so you could click on that. Make sure you're liking and subscribing. But I talk about that a lot in this series on how things are really changing for the collective, for humanity in general. And you're going to want to tap in and you're not going to want to miss these opportunities for growth and transformation okay but there are many karmic cycles that are wrapping up right now you guys if you can you know pay attention to the ebb and the flow if you pay, can pay attention to the seasons and the cycles you'll see a pattern where you know you're you're at this precipice or you're at this crossroads and you're needing to make a decision you're needing to cut out things that no longer serve you cut out people places things because you're about to go to the next level and this is really what i'm talking about when i say you know what a time to be alive it's because we're at this moment in time where those cycles are clearing for us when we're not you know tied down to these karmic lessons where many of us have learned all that we needed to learn about a specific situation or experience that we've we've gone through so this is something to be really excited about you guys because you know if you have been running up against some resistance or some blockages for for um for some time now these uh blockages are being wrapped up for you it's literally divine intervention you know it's literally the age that this planet is going in um that humanity is going in so you're gonna want to you know get tapped into that and take advantage okay um and you know the veil is lifting people are starting to see the puppet strings that have been you know attached to people that have been attached to these systems that are in place for us and um you know it's it's the dying of illusions it's the really cutting of illusions. People are putting two and two together. You know, they're realizing that, you know, the powers that be, you know, they're, everyone, everyone doesn't have your best interests at heart. You know, many people have ulterior motives, 
okay and you know knowing who you are allows you to be better able to um i guess navigate that because not everybody is on your side <laughs> you know what i mean but when you know yourself you can conduct, conduct yourself ac accordingly and you know you're staying in alignment with the world and the reality that you want to create so you know those of us who like i said know who we are we know what time we're living in we know where we're supposed to be we know our soul's purpose we are excited about this time and you know we don't feed into the distractions and the manipulation and the illusions we see things very very clearly um, and in my other videos on uh, YouTube, I talk about that, you know, many of us have, you know, we heard, we heard the call of the universe, we heard the call of the divine. And we're like, all right, boom, let's go. You know, many of us, it was like an instantaneous choice, like, all right, I'm with it. And others of us, we had to wrap up certain things in our lives. We couldn't just hop up and leave or, you know, wherever you are, it doesn't matter if you decide to travel or not. But wherever you are, many of us had to go through a process in order to get ready. We we definitely had to go through a transformation and um, an initiation stage. Many of us have. And we we are now understanding like, okay, like I am more powerful than I thought. Like, I have much more control over the things that I'm experiencing than I thought. Um, you know, you're empowering yourself. You're loving yourself. You're getting to know yourself. You're um, releasing any things that you need to re release. Any uh, attachments, any um, old thought forms and ideologies, relationships that were detrimental to you in the past. And, you know, many of you guys have really put in the work to heal to heal yourselves and to do better and you know to keep trying and keep pushing and keep moving those of you who have been doing that you're really going to start to reap the benefits of that of making those changes of wanting to do better and um and i'm really happy for all of us i'm really excited for you guys like I said, if you guys um, watch me on YouTube, Tierra Neil Chardé, I do the Divine Message for the Collective every day, Monday through Friday. And there is a pattern where people are letting go of things that just, they don't even matter anymore. They're old stuff. You know, you guys are healing that, you're wrapping it up, you're putting it away, you're burying this, you're wiping things down. Because intuitively, you can feel feel your next step coming like you can feel that next level you guys know that you're like right in the doorway of something amazing you know something that you've been hoping and wishing for and you're absolutely right your intuition is on point so you know be excited to be alive right now you guys no matter where you are no matter where you're at you know and try not to focus on things that you don't have Focus on what you do have and know that you have the power to create more, more abundance, more love, health, awareness, whatever you're trying to create, you have that power. So connect, get closer to yourself. Um, you know, if you guys need my assistance, you can reach out to me on my website, tiarasharday.com. Again, I have some links in the description box for you guys. You can check me out tomorrow on YouTube. Um, I mentioned it before, but I believe like the syncing for YouTube Live isn't really the best right now, you guys. So I may have to pre-record in the morning, uh, pre-record your divine messages, but they will still be up there on YouTube between 9 and 10. I think that's 10 and 11 um, Eastern time, I believe. So that's when those messages will be up. And on Fridays, I give you the forecast for your weekend. So you know what to expect for um, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And also, you guys, so on Monday, I'll be doing a divine message for the collective. But I'll start doing it according to the element of the zodiac signs. So earth signs, air signs, water, and fire signs, I'll start doing that this Monday. So Monday through, Friday, uh, Monday through Thursday. 
and then on friday i'll continue with your weekend forecast okay you guys so again that's on my youtube channel the link is in the description box so make sure you subscribe right now thank you so much make sure you set your notifications so you know when i'm going live and when i'm dropping videos and make sure you share this video especially if it resonates with you and you got something out of it so we want to make sure that people really get the love and they get the positive vibes and you know just spread that knowledge okay so that is all thank you so much for joining me and i'll see you tomorrow peace and love Mwah.